This is definitely a 2-3 season tent, but we dare on the side of using it during one distinct season, summer. It's a dome-style design, which means it'll have less headroom than a cabin-style alternative. That said, its shape improves wind resistance because it's not basically a giant block that's more likely to succumb to heavy winds. It's not freestanding, so you'll need a place where there's relatively soft dirt for the stakes to go in all the way. Don't try to set this tent up on rocks or other hard surfaces. The major advantage of the Grand Pass is its weight and pack size. Analysis comparisons and test results, performance comparison. In the process of researching this tent, we tested and compared it against others with a similar size and design. We evaluated each tent on setup time, durability of materials, craftsmanship, ability to withstand variable weather, comfort, and a variety of additional factors. Value for money. In terms of value, the Grand Pass 10 ranks high on our list because it's more affordable than many other tents of a similar size. For its price, you'll get a tent that offers great size, good ventilation, easy setup, and a compact design. Ease of use, the Grand Pass comes with five shock corded fiberglass poles that provide the majority of the support for its structure. The two main shock corded poles are easy to insert through the sleeves on the body and they cross at the top to form an X shape. Durability and workmanship, the floor is constructed of polyethylene, which is a very common material used for flooring in many of the best large tents. The windows and doors are mesh polyester and the main body is also polyester. The rain fly is constructed of nylon material. Weather resistance, as I mentioned earlier, this tent is best suited to mild summer conditions. While its dome shape makes it more adept at handling high winds than some cabin style tents, the fact that the rain fly barely covers the roof means it didn't perform too well in rainy or wet conditions. Comfort, although it boasts a 10-person capacity, we found it to be a little tight with 8 people, so we recommend it for parents with a maximum of 4 kids, really. This tent's best application is for a large family on a budget. It might not last as long as other models, but it also won't break the bank if you're not going to use it all that often. Well, this is my observation with this particular model. Maybe you've experienced something different. So, it would be a pleasure if you share yours in the comments section below for the rest of the viewers. Thank you for watching this video. Wish you a great day.